<laughs> You're really overwhelming me. Okay. Where's the gum? Gum, 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 gum. Hey guys, this is Jessica Alba. I'm here with the star of all stars, Patrick Starr, and he is helping me launch my YouTube channel. So this is officially the first video. I'm and good. I am here and we're gonna be doing things and he is schooling my ass on how to do YouTube and I'm learning for really from the best and I thank you so much. I'm so honored. It's your first collaboration. You are literally just going full throttle. Yeah, full throttle. So I did his makeup and he did my makeup. Mm -hmm. And so you have to look at his channel <laughs> to look at the transformation because you've never seen me look like that before. Girl. It is amazing. Yes, and then on me, she did a full phase of Honest Beauty her way. And I have never had any other celebrity of celebrities touch me because it has been refused and denied. But Jessica <laughs> Alba has been so gracious enough to lay her teensy weensy little fingers on my big ass face oh. so i'm so honored and oh, i love so the honored. look and if you guys out there that have similar skin to me textured hyperpigmentation that love a little bit of love i'm um, featuring all honest beauty items be sure to stay tuned and yeah. see how she does it yeah and you can actually have clean products with clean ingredients that loves your skin and allows your skin to breathe and be healthy and bring out the best in you. Awesome. So there we go. Let's get started. I'm nervous. Don't okay, be nervous. this is fun. Do you ever use a serum before you put your makeup on? Sometimes I'm so tired, I just slap whatever the hell's on my table. Okay, okay. But we're, 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 we're starting, guys. Okay, we're starting. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm on your channel. I can't believe that. So we'll do the intro and the outro after, right? After, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. She's learning. You can do it right here. No, I don't, no, to me. Oh, <laughs> oh. You can hold it here because that's a second close up cam. Okay. Mm -hmm. It looks like. Oh my gosh. Looks like. What are we using mm -hmm. today, Jessica Alba? <laughs> using vitamin C radiant serum. <laughs> to, so that you can look more radiant, even more than you already are. Girl, I look like an mm -hmm. egg. Oh my gosh, she's touching me. You know, when I tell you this girl has cojones, she said, <laughs> Dime, let me do your makeup. And I'm so honored because I haven't, you don't even ask Patrick Ta. And he wouldn't? And, no, he's like, no. Why? He's too scared to do my face. I mean, it's intimidating. It is not, girl. I, I'm but I'm not a makeup artist, so I think no, that allows me to not be like... I think it's like... going to be so cool to see your techniques so I can apply it. Because literally, I, I don't, to be, to be, hold on. To be honest, <laughs> I literally do not wear a full face every day. It almost takes me like an hour to do it. Oh. The full Patrick Star look, uh -huh. contact lashes, and also... I, like, I would wear this going out. I even wore this on a date. Oh. Yeah, and we still talking. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, hopefully, you know, him and I can be like, passion <laughs> jazz, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> And we can have fantastic three someday. I mean, you know. So, okay, so, so serum first. Serum first, and then I'm gonna use the hydrogel, which is a water-based mm -hmm. moisturizer. And what's nice is the water breaks. And I think it's important whether you have oily skin or whether you have combo skin mm -hmm. or dry skin mm -hmm. to have the right amount of moisturization and hydration mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. as a base. So mm -hmm. I'm gonna go behind you. <gasps> oh. oh, she's a top. <laughs> How'd you know? Ooh. The way you touching me. Not that I'm a bottom, that's not what I was saying, Jessica. Oh my gosh. This is how you do your face in the morning? Some I, serum um, and then that, the hydrogel? Yeah, and I think it's nice to like give yourself like a little massage and massage it in. Mm -hmm. And then my friend who's Korean, she taught me. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> Oh, you nasty. <laughs> you na That's how she had three kids out. That she mad. <laughs> right. She said that her mom looks really good and she just like hits her face every single day. So like a Uh-huh. Do you hit your face every day? Um, I just give it a little, you know. I try to look like you because you a little, look like, the same. Bah! Yeah. So I do a nice like massage and then I do brrrr. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. I love it. Oh my gosh. And sometimes I use tools. Oh, but... tool tools? <laughs> <laughs> what kind of tools? <laughs> you hit me from the back and you spanking me and you talk about tools. What kind of video this is? Yo, girls back there are laughing. They are flagging your PR team right now. <laughs> Jessica Alba exposed. It's going to be your first exposed video on YouTube. You exposed that. <laughs> Welcome to digital media. Nobody knows. Oh my gosh. You know. Guys, we've been having so much fun. I glammed her. So if you guys missed it, check it out on my channel. We're doing some cross pollinate. What is going on? 
Oh my God. What is this product? This is the cream foundation. Mm -hmm. And when you're trying to get like a more natural looking vibe, but you still want to have the contour, I mm -hmm. think it's nice to lay it down underneath. So we're still going to put the sunscreen on top, mm -hmm. but I think it's nice to lay this down and I do this. And it's also mm -hmm. um, how I hide my contour when I'm working on a TV show or a movie. Oh my gosh. And so this is also the cream foundation mm -hmm. and this one's in beige. I'm mm -hmm. just going to make sure it matches. See you guys, you may know me online, but that's all I'm known for is just being online. And I'm digitally native online, so I haven't had accolades on being on magazine covers and movies and red carpets galore. So it's it's really but cool. All the kids know you. I know, but it's so interesting. Knows me. But see, I had to really dig behind the scenes and watch videos that were available back in 2007, 8, when YouTube was starting, of what was available as far as beauty. And it wasn't much, you know? And a lot of y'all celebrities was keeping it hush hush. Yeah, we, we did. We had to Google all your pictures and make do. But it's just really cool that you're able to like just really just close all the secrets and things and what she showed on my channel too. But it's cool. You've been a cover girl with other brands. Now you have your own brand, yeah. movies and And now I get to be where everyone else is now. I mean Aww. it just took a hot minute for me to catch up to you. Yeah. But you're so inspiring and you've been Aww. able to touch so many people on a daily basis and inspire so many people. And I know my kids are such a big fan. And, you know, having the younger generation and having them be, be able to have someone like you to look up to, it's just so mm. important. Mm, thank you. I'm so shook. You're touching my face. Mm -hmm. And who else makeup have you done? You've done Mariana Hewitt. I've done Mariana's. Who else? Monica Blender's. Oh my gosh. I'm proud to start. Well, and, well, yeah, duh. Plug, plug, plug. And Patrick Star. <laughs> Patrick Star, guys. I, we're just gonna have a banner. <laughs> Patrick Star, right here. Okay, so this is um, something that Aurora, my makeup artist on LA's Finest, and she does a bunch of movies, and she does this on me mm -hmm. so that we can kind of hide the contour because mm -hmm. the DP always complains whenever he sees makeup and so this is a way to sort of and LA's Finest is a on show. LA's Finest is a TV show yeah but we, even on TV shows they do the same thing yeah because oh. they want you to look like you're not wearing anything but you know what's so funny when I get booked for <laughs> TV stuff sometimes they want the makeup yeah <laughs> it's but, just crazy because I'm known for makeup so I really can't see from the outside and what else they would want from me because I'm not I'm so versatile but I'm just saying it's just interesting to see all the hear all the techniques yeah mm -hmm. you're still getting a um SPF, so this is SPF 30, mm -hmm. and it's a CCC, so it mm -hmm. basically has the same thing that the Radiance Vitamin C has. Mm -hmm. So uh, the more you wear it, the healthier your skin is, mm. and the brighter your skin will be. I'm putting it on, <laughs> putting it on, putting it on. <laughs> Put it on me. I want to look like you. <laughs> and Gabrielle, you mean. Yeah, and she is flawless skin too, that one. It's crazy. But you are literally a lifestyle superstar. <laughs> Like, it's just so crazy throughout all the years. It's just like, you were acting, mm -hmm. but just lifestyle came into play just naturally. Like, you were like, I was saying in my video that everyone liked you for hair, and then your skin, and then on all the magazines, Jessica Alba's secret this, secret <laughs> that, love life, this and that, makeup, and it's just fashion. Like, you were like, like booked for everything other than just acting. It was just like acting and, and yeah, also I your roles were all versatile too. So it just were. made you so, I think your roles transparently made you like so well-rounded in your real life too. And then now you have the brand. It's not just beauty, but you have cleaning supplies that are clean. You have yeah. baby, you have mommy. Yeah. She said she might have fitness and book me for fit. Oh my God, <laughs> my skin. Oh my gosh. Well, I don't have fitness, but I think it would be fun if we did some kind of fitness videos together. And you know what is so it funny? Just, it's more fun with friends. Yeah. Oh, I'll be friends. <laughs> yeah. Where's my mic? Is it, <laughs> we're friends. Oh my God. Uh, Am I heavy handed? No. A little bit. My makeup artist, Ronnie, bitch. She punches me. <laughs> She's a heavy-handed woman. When I heard Pat McGrath backstage, she loves like mixing hands and warming it up and putting it on the face. And also with Charlotte Tilbury, like warming up skincare, taking care of the skin and then putting makeup on the face. And then you too, hitting me from the back, you know, and slapping <laughs> me and tossing me around. Yeah. And it's, it's not just about, I think, putting something on your canvas and covering mm -hmm. it up, but mm -hmm. if you can take care of what's underneath yes. as well, then it, it's also about self-care. Mm -hmm. 
you know, and giving yourself that moment where you get to really mm -hmm. give yourself that a little loving. Mm -hmm. We're living in an age where skincare is, and you have skincare too. Yeah, we have really nice skincare. Yes, and the um, the skincare. I think we we live, we live in an age where skincare is merging with makeup. beauty and yeah. makeup. It used to be so separate, but I always mm. was obsessed with skin, especially as an actress, because you would see everything. Mm -hmm. My close-up is, mm -hmm. you know, the screen is this big in a movie. But you look and so you can see everything. I would scream if I was <laughs> that big on the screen. No, you better. Oh my gosh, but it's, it's really, really cool. And I love it. Oh my God, zoom in on my skin. Hold on. And I, ooh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did Patrick I train you or something, Monica? <laughs> they Who? did. Yeah, I think I took something from all the makeup artists, you know, growing up in this business. And then my mom. Oh, because she was a beautician. Darling. Yeah, she she always loved makeup. She always loved to mm. glam. She would not leave the house to take me to school, go to the grocery store without a full face. Oh my God, really? Oh yeah, and she wore all the colors. And for all y'all out there, Jessica Alba from the IE. Yup. She from the IE? Okay, yep. And let me tell you, it shows. I love it. I think what's really cool is, I think with my full face series, trying other brands, I think the assumption for people that have full coverage and then clean beauty don't put the two together because it's too should... clean, it's thin, it's just natural. So you could still get the performance, which I'm so, Gogged. Yeah, you've never had that before. No. And that's what I, that's what I was so frustrated with, is that I felt like you just weren't getting the performance and, mm -hmm. with the clean formulas, and that's why we formulate in house. Yes. You should see the so lab. Good. It's really cool, and right. the chemist. It's the date. Yeah, it's really fun. Mm -hmm. And it's nice when you can like customize and you just have a one off. It's like there's nothing more special than that. That's so crazy. Oh my God, you are such a. So, what she did was she contoured underneath, and the colors that we use is snow. And this is a um, foundation and a cream to powder. And then she used Java okay. um, kind of around. And then to blend everything over, you put the newest luminous finish, tinted moisturizer in the color medium. When I first started doing YouTube, Mm -hmm. Believe it or not, I was at a gym. Believe it or not, I was at a gym, right? Mm -hmm. And that's when my channel started to you, grow. Wait, did you wear a full face at the gym? No, I did not. But then when I, I think I had full crystal nails and I was, believe it or not, doing weights. <laughs> and I got Plus. recognized by this girl. She's like, oh my God, are you Patrick Star? I said, how the hell do you know me? Like, I'm not in, I'm not in my Patrick Star look. Mm -hmm. And I forgot that people would recognize me from before the, the before and the, 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 the before like the right. makeup so I, I i thought people were just more so about like the full face patrick star and that's what they associated with mm -hmm. so it's just really interesting to see the vulnerability that digital media has been able to offer through the lens of and how do you feel camera. when you're walking around without full face oh i love it because i think you know there's no difference in how people react i think with, right. when i full face patrick star with the like the huge Glamour. lashes and the contacts. Mm -hmm. it's, it's just the same because I've been able to vlog on my channel and kind of also participate in lifestyle and vlogs. And I think people see that for what it is. And I think it's really important because every day I get messages on my Instagram, on Twitter, on my Facebook about how much of an inspiration I am. And I'm not a music artist where I'm like literally performing for thousands of people hearing the the roar of applause, you know? So, but to see the audiences from Africa, from the Middle East to Asia, Latin America, it's just, even, even here, just to see like, say, oh my God, you're an inspiration, you're saving my life. Like, it, it's just really cool. And I think with the help of the celebrity, I think it's really awesome that People can still continue to, to still be on this earth because of who they see online and inspiration. Yeah, it's true. So it's true. It's it's crazy. Do you get emotional? I do. I do. It's a little bit overwhelming sometimes when you think about that many messages. Like, oh my god. Like, if I've done like personal appearances or events, and like, oh my god, you're an inspiration. You have no idea. It's just crazy because, again, I don't see it. But, um, oh my god. But what I do see is this face. <laughs> Wait, this powder, wait, 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 powder's my favorite step. Don't skip, don't skip, don't skip. You is like a professional makeup artist. This is the powder. 
And this oh, this is the one that I used on you. Yeah. And this is the Invisible Blurring Powder, and it's nice because it works on all skin tones. Mm -hmm. It does. And, um, I and used it, it on you. Mm -hmm, used it on me, and then I used it on you. And what's nice is um, you can layer it, but it doesn't look cakey. Mm -hmm. And you have this little well, and which you can, like, dab. tap the excess and catch it. You know, I feel like when I'm at hotels, I feel like the cleaning people. Mm hmm Steal your makeup? No. No. <laughs> Swear that whoever stayed there is a crackhead because I dump all my loose powder on the table or on, on like oh, a napkin. Oh, they think you're doing like, drugs. They think I'm doing like drugs. I'm like, no, no, no. I just, I just because I don't have, this would help me tons. Oh, Because right. most of my powders that I've seen have like just a sifter. And I literally turn it over and go doom, doom, doom. Like and I'm knocking this, on a door. Do you do this kind of powder? Yeah. Or you yeah. do this, the, mm -hmm. that yeah. one? Uh-huh. It's because I'm so expressive and... I think, you know, if you were to think, uh, the reason why I started baking too is not just because of drag makeup and for the intensity of it, for the simple anatomy of, of a male skin is, is different. I think there's a lot of girls mm -hmm. who use this trick as well. Yeah, but I'll, I'll also, also girls too. But I also wanted to share like how men in makeup can get the look. Yeah, it's nice that there's techniques where the makeup can stay on your face, mm -hmm. sort of like no matter what you're doing. Mm -hmm. And so whether you're, you know, doing a lot of facial expressions and mm -hmm. you're doing the most, or if you're just walking around and just not wanting your face to fall off mm -hmm. midday, mm -hmm. which is, I think everyone wants yes. that one. It's nice to have a couple of techniques and you can learn a lot from stage makeup. Yes, I well. love it. So what are your plans for your YouTube channel? Tell the kids since, you know. So my plans are, I just want to just be creative and do fun stuff and mm -hmm. I also want to pay homage to mm -hmm. the OGs and that's why I'm just so honored that you oh my God. are doing this video. Girl, and Chappies, you are an OG, girl. You was my childhood. <laughs> Black when I was straight, girl. <laughs> just kidding. I've always been gay, but I'm just saying, if I was straight ever, you was it. Literally, I grew up with you. Literally, oh. I've been watching like old, not old movies, but like like, like movies old from movies? my no, old like movies from my child movies old? from my childhood, girl, my adolescence <laughs> before the balls dropped. You know what I'm saying? It was just very that, and it's just everyone is just like Jessica Alba. She's there. I literally watched uh, Never Been Kissed, and I said, I oh know God, her. Yeah, you was there. Mm -hmm. oh, man, that, all those days, mm -hmm. so many memories. Uh, she's clutching my nose. Let's tell the kids, what are you using? I'm using the, um, this one, but I'm, I can go in with yours because it's a little deeper and I feel like you yeah. probably like no, it better. Whichever. So I'm using the um, dust reflection and it has some, a little bit of mica. So it's, you know, it has a little bit more reflection and it just mm -hmm. looks like skin and it kind of yes. like um, goes on top of it and doesn't, isn't as like, if you don't want to have as strong mm -hmm. of a look, if you mm -hmm. want to have a little bit more of a subtle. So, but I can mix it with yours as well. No, whichever. I love it. Just do your thing. I'm obsessed. So when you made your products, mm -hmm. did you like go into the lab and start from scratch? Like how, what's that process like? Oh my gosh, yeah. The lab, presentations, touch, playing, and feeling. Literally, it's like it's intense so dating. It's like hooking up. <laughs> you really it have is. to like get in it with the product. And then this is your Patrick Star yeah. Give Me Life bronzing powder. Give Me Life, yeah, that was it. That was crazy. That was my third collection with MAC. I was able to do five collections with MAC. What? Five collections Look internationally. Up. And what's crazy is I, I worked at MAC. Right, that's and, where you started. Yeah, and I was asked to remove my makeup I mean, at look. MAC. No. Yes. No. T. What? Yes. That doesn't Shade. make any sense. I know, because I think in, in Orlando, it was like too much for them all. And then what? I think it was such a pinch me moment to have been asked to when do. When it comes back around the yeah, circle. Yeah, yeah. That's when mm. everyone was like big. So right now I'm getting a little bit of the um, elevated hydrating mist and I'm wetting it and I'm going into these two colors, soft bronze mm -hmm. and Which one? burnt mocha. Oh yeah. You got it. And then I'm gonna get into your lash line. Mm -hmm. So look up. Do you wanna do more makeup and more product mm -hmm. development or no? I think so, I think it's so fun. I think, you know what, ever since I was little, Close. Um, ever since I was young, I realized I've always been obsessed with a process. So whether that was making home videos, whether that was makeup, whether that was doing hairdos and updos for my friends for prom or, 
doing a photo shoot. So you do shoot. hair too? Yeah, I do hair. I mean, I could snatch your wig here <laughs> and there. It's just really, really fun. And I think the thing about YouTube is that because it is so turn, pretty much turnkey, like you create, you erase, and then you upload. And you get immediate. And then you do it again. You Immediate satisfaction, yeah. instant gratification. That's awesome. And you get to see the, yes. the reward. It's so It is really fun. cool. And you can have that direct relationship with people. Mm. You do it too because you create, you create a movie, role, persona. Yeah, but I'm not in charge of it. But now you are. Now I am. Now you are. So I think I think that's even. why this is so interesting to, for me as a creative person mm -hmm. and part of the creative process is mm -hmm. to be able to own it, mm -hmm. soup to nuts. And after starting my business, mm -hmm. it feels weird putting all of my work into someone else's hands. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know? Because that's what essentially what happens. Yeah, I realized that. I had that same sentiment, that exact same sentiment when I was playing piano. Okay. So I was studying classical piano when I was 15. Oh, really? Yeah, I was a piano teacher. Oh, wow. Yeah, I can teach your kids piano. I can give them piano lessons. Oh my God. Yeah, if they don't already. No, they, they've been, they're actually self-taught because they're both oh just gosh. passionate about yeah? playing music and they teach themselves songs from YouTube. Oh, cool. And, and they learn by ear and then they sing. That's so cute. It's really cute. I didn't believe that they wanted it. And uh -huh. then, but they really like Well, the apples don't fall far from the tree. But I mean, I'm, I'm not talented Honey. like that. Yep. <laughs> I mean, you were booked and busy for many, many years, so yeah. that, there's some talent and truth to that. Well, so. so I don't feel comfortable putting on mascara okay. on other people. So this is the mascara so that's... So this is the mascara, and it has primer. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. And mascara. Guys, she made this component because she had this <laughs> idea in her mind. She was talking to me for about 30 minutes. I know. And she was like, I love this component. <laughs> and it's so cool because a lot of mascaras that are double-ended that I have seen are, are even. This one is just so cool. And also there was no other that that was out in the market. I was the first one and the others got me. Oh my God. She keeps it honest up in here. So wait, so you said something about 30 seconds? Yeah, so coat. Okay. The hell out of those lashes okay. with that primer and let it sit for like 30 seconds. And, and what does it 30 seconds do? It just allows the primer to sit and to set and to basically like become your extra lashes. It's like um, lash extensions. This is a nice coat because you can even wear this at night mm -hmm. and it will protect your lashes from falling out and stuff. Oh my God, really? Because mm -hmm, it puts do a protective you do coat. Sometimes, oh. when I did go through wearing false lashes a lot mm. and my lashes were falling out, I did do this at night when I was trying to grow mm. them. Yeah, I think it looks One, good. Two. No. <laughs> do you guys have a toothbrush? Oh, do you have a spoolie? Jessica, I was gonna brush my teeth. <laughs> a spoolie and then where's the magic balm? Here's a trick. Mm -hmm. um, when you're gonna put on a long wear mm -hmm. lip, uh -huh. I think it's nice to have really smooth lips. So get a spoolie and put it in the magic balm, and then I'm gonna give this to you and uh -huh. just scrub the. So this is something we formulated in house, and we have this really cool mm -hmm. chemist that came up with this bad boy, and it basically doesn't have any of the nasty or harsh chemicals mm -hmm. that a lot of the other long wear lips have. Mm -hmm. So it's more comfortable and flexible mm -hmm. wear. That's so crazy. You do everything in house. And we try to do as much as possible, mm. given our bandwidth, and if we can really do something super special. Mm -hmm. I'm so gagged. People are going to be like, mm -hmm. Jessica Alba did your makeup, and it looked good. I'm so gagged. Oh my god, it's been 30 minutes, so now I can put on, <laughs> now I can put on 30 the, seconds. <laughs> oh my gosh. Blink through the wand. Yeah, let's look at your you lashes on. No, no, when I tell you, sometimes when it be like the morning after and I want to hit up mm -hmm. like a food truck or something mm -hmm. or get some Filipino food, like the last thing I want to do is fuss and muss with some lashes. But I've never thought about using um, primer. It like doubles the size. It does. Oh my God. If I could be any more thick. Oh my God. <laughs> Let me find out you know something about thick. <laughs> I love it. Will you put a little bit on the bottom? Oh, I don't know if you were going to do any more. She's like, you're not fucking done. <laughs> oh my God, you really did my makeup. I mean, I feel like I should have caked on more because I feel like no, it might be no, mad. no, no, no. I'm not. No, this is literally. I feel like you're ass. like, I don't know. No, I swear. 
This is honestly what I would do. For real. Okay. I just don't want to disappoint you. No, yeah, what do you mean? <laughs> Girl, I love, I was more, I was so scared doing your makeup. No, you weren't. Uh, yes, I was. All right, guys, I put on my false lashes and Jessica Alba is doing my makeup and she's gonna <laughs> apply this blush. Yes, it's foxy. It's lip powder blush. And you're so foxy, so. Oh, are you flirting? Let me find out you flirting with me, uh -oh. dude. Let me find out you flirting <laughs> with me. And this blush is, is gorgeous because it's kind of like a two-in-one because she has a little bit of mac in it for that glow. Yeah, it gives you that nice glow. And it just looks really pretty on all skin tones. And you just look so youthful. Oh my god. And foxy and flushed. I love it. Oh my god, I love it. Ta. I'm gonna book you tomorrow, 5 a.m., okay? <laughs> I'm booking tomorrow. You heard that? You heard that, team? Cancel tomorrow. I'm booking Jessica Alba to do my makeup tomorrow. Oh my gosh. All right. Are we done? Yeah, we're done. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is the makeup, no makeup look. <laughs> I know, I love it. Zoom in, please, all the way. This natural beauty right here. Oh my God, cheek to cheek. Mm. Oh my gosh, with Jessica Alba. I'm almost as pretty as you. You look so great. Way prettier. Guys, look, she's gorgeous. Welcome to YouTube. Welcome to YouTube. <laughs> Thank you. Gosh. All right, guys, this is the finished look on Patrick Starr, I the queen. Love it. He's amazing, and he allowed me to actually touch his face and do his makeup, and I'm so honored. And likewise, I did your face. I was so nervous, and... And That's I had so, so much fun. Yes. And I feel like so we need to be fun. friends. Yes, we're gonna be friends. We're gonna eat. We're gonna dance. We're gonna party. We're gonna do TikTok because together. We're basically neighbors. <laughs> we are neighbors, and I'm so honored, and it's such an honor. And to we're have. gonna push each other out of our comfort zone. Yes, let's do it. I think that'll be fun. A true star, a legend. Thank you so much for having me, oh, Jessica. Thank you. Alba. If you want to see more videos, subscribe to my channel and look below. For more videos? Yeah. Is that what I say? More videos, subscribe. Okay. Thumbs up. Um, make sure that you subscribe, like, and share. And check below um, because Patrick did a full glam makeover on me and you have to see the video because it is a true transformation. I've never looked as good. Ciao. It's amazing. Dang, baby. Check it out. <laughs> see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.